Good job, Ron. Oh. You're on TV. I'm on TV. Well, Facebook. Oh. That might not be a good thing. <laughs> oh. Here's in. Where are you from Canada? I'm from Quebec. Right. I'm in Quebec. I got a pair of draft horses. Yeah, what do you got? Well, they're just, you know, great drafts, but for a beginner like me, yeah. you know? Yeah. And uh, I've been following the Green Mountain Draft Horse Association on Facebook. Oh. And I'm um, was hoping to meet Jean, you know? Well, she should be back. I know. Okay. I don't know. I haven't seen this equipment yet ever operating. Oh. I've got a hobby farm yeah, and I'm good. taking my driving good. certificate and I drive a wagon and a sleigh and a cart and good. I'm getting there and I got all kinds of equipment lying around waiting to be used. This will be corn next year, that'll be wheat, and then their hay crop will be up the other side of them white trucks. Anytime you want to hook on the plows, mister, or the heralds, whatever you want. I don't think so, I was just balling up on you. Yeah, it's not. But that that gives you more room anyway, so. Yeah. Yeah, that's, yeah. You want a plow or you want a harrow? Uh, don't make me. Well, I had to go get my tutor trap, but it don't make me no difference. Oh, that's right, too. I don't have them. I'll go get them. I was going to bring them jockey sticks I had, too. Damn it, we didn't like that. Yeah. Yeah. You, you from around here? Uh, Innisburg. Innisburg? Yeah. Are you in the Green Mountain Draft Horse Association? Yes, I am. We both are. Yeah. I was following you on Facebook. Yeah, she put me on Facebook all the time, <laughs> Serena. Are you Jean? No, Serena. Serena, I'm Faye Cotton. Uh, hi, how are you? Fine. You want to leave the tutor straps? If we hook on the plows, we're going to have to. The hounds, we ain't going to. I'm going to leave the tutor straps. <laughs> tutor straps? What are they? Uh, to work on them neck yokes right there, the difference in my neck yokes. Oh, you've got the D-ring harness. I got the D-ring. Tell me what's so great about the D-ring harness here. I. It I, work puts more weight on the back instead of the shoulders. Well, I don't know. I was brought up with them, and I guess I don't know. In Quebec, the guys that live in the Beauce region, right up against the states, they use these a lot. Yeah. They hardly use them anymore, and. Uh, Yours is all leather, beautiful brass on there, eh? Yeah, well, when I'm in the woods, I like, when I go down the hills and stuff, I like more than a buckle under the belly to hold me back, you know. And and you've got a check rein on these guys? Yes, I do. What for? Just for looks? More, well, I, I show them a lot, and they usually knock points off, so I just oh, leave yeah. them on. And oh, God. Okay. You show these horses, eh? Oh, yeah. That's a Percheron and a Belgian? Yes. Yeah. Beautiful. How old are they? He's 18. 18? Yeah. They still go going good? She's 15. Oh, wow. Yeah. Have you had them all this time? No. Uh, when I got him, he was a John horse. He used to be a John horse. A John horse? Drawing, like stone boats and stuff. Okay. And he was in a pasture for about a year and a half, and I knew a friend, and yeah. he said, you just well use him if you want her, and so I put him with her, and we've been going ever since. Second time I had them hooked together, we did a wedding. Oh. Yeah. I know flies bother you, I know that. So, it seemed to go pretty good, but since I joined the club, they're going with Larry and stuff, you know, we love it. We kind of getting away from showing and going to stuff like that. We went to Rupert. And you have a farm yourself? I don't really, well, yeah, no, it ain't a big one, it just, yeah, like 15, 20 acres and yeah, stuff, yeah. Know where the horses go, and, and it, it's, it's fun. Mm -hmm. I like do the four up someday. Four up, yeah? yeah. A lot going on here, eh? Oh, yeah. Boy, oh, boy, it sure smells good, too. <laughs> Yeah, for you here, now, three oh, 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 I better set my alarm clock. <laughs> I just watched the junior cart singles. Yeah. That was cute. Yeah, kids are great. Yeah. That was Very wonderful. Down yeah. Well, you'll feel level. It'll straighten the stuff out to use that level. You just make a little white turn and get yourself set up in the corner. Yes, so. <laughs> sure. Okay. It'll take a minute for you to get comfortable. It'll take more than a minute. <laughs> uh, yeah, just bring it right around now. Give me a
Take your time swinging them around too. Thank you. We won't plow too deep for them. Yeah, because just to get them used to it. Right, they don't have a clue what I'm doing. I don't either. This is the way to do it. I don't have a clue what I'm doing either. So this wheel should run right along the edge of your throw. This idea. Yeah. This wheel here should run right, right. along here. Close to that. Yeah, as close as you can. As long as he's walking that furrow, it should stay right there. Okay. Yeah. And, and nothing. And nothing? Nothing. Just keep a nice hold on them so they're walking. That's the biggest part. So they walk. Send it. Don't. Send it. Send it. Don't.